We've seen sky high daily COVID-19 case counts recently, including a pandemic high recorded late last week. But a University of Michigan doctor predicts the end may be in sight when it comes to the COVID-19 pandemic. He tells 13 on your side's Charlie Tinker the increasing numbers support that claim. This year is, is a real turning point. And before 2022 comes to a close, there'll still be some infections. Certainly, there'll still be evidence that the virus is mutating. The pandemic. Coronavirus as a pandemic will end. Dr. Jim Baker is not exactly going out on a limb. The waves of infection that we're seeing are starting to damp down. He's a University of Michigan clinical immunologist and director of the Michigan Nanotechnology Institute for Medicine and the Biological Sciences. We've been able to really reduce the impact. His work at the moment involves putting the body's immune response to the vaccine under the microscope and studying any side effects. And there's a national study that's underway underway at 30 centers across the country and their findings which baker says should be made public in the next few months i think this should be reassuring to people yet for all of that cutting edge research we've seen both the benefit and the limitations it's another pandemic in the spanish flu that may point the way out of this one the patterns are actually very similar one or two very severe waves and then the next one's tend to be more and more subdued. And yet when the 1918 Spanish flu left the world on its back around a century earlier, simple prevention strategies were all doctors could throw at it. 21st century technology says Baker offers a distinct advantage in the here and now. We have uh, diagnostics that are so effective uh, you know, we can tell when people are shedding virus and aren't clinically ill. You know, in, in prior pandemics, no one would have even identified those folks as being sick. While the doctor's data points to a year-end expiration date. Clearly, this is a difficult time. It's not over until it's over. Most people are going to become infected. And getting the jab. The real way to end this pandemic even sooner is to have everyone get vaccinated. Charlie Tinker, 13 on your side.